Happy Arbor Day, everybody. Today is the day to celebrate and plant trees. On this holiday, we have chosen to highlight two trees that thrive in New York City, and we'll leave you singing, oops, I planted again, after you pick them up for free at any NYRP tree giveaway, the Service Berry and Eastern Redbud. Now let's get started with Emelinkir Levis, commonly known as the Allegheny Service Berry. Check out those flowers swaying in the breeze with those five long elliptic petals. Don't they look like white stars scattered about the grove? Don't get me started about those leaves that emerge purple and bronze in the spring, turning green in the summer, followed by the crimson and golden hues of the fall. These service berries can be kept as large shrubs or smaller trees and can handle the elements of an urban environment. Now, is it Nelly or is it just me? Because it feels like New York City is getting hot in here. As the city's annual temperatures continue to rise with the gradual onset of global warming, it is important to plant trees that can withstand a warmer climate whilst combating the heat island effect. If you want to grow some shade on climate change, you can pick up a free service berry at one of NYRP's tree giveaways. The next tree that we are showcasing this Arbor Day is Circus Canadensis, also known as the Eastern Redbud. This tree is a showstopper, well known throughout the East Coast due to its prevalent use in landscaping. We can thank the darling buds of April and May that blossom into pink, magenta, and sometimes white flowers. Okay, we truly cannot stop praising these showy flowers. Found in clusters from spring to early summer, they can appear on the bare stems, along the branches, and even on the trunk itself before the leaves emerge. The redbud is definitely known for its flowers, but keep an eye out for those heart-shaped leaves that will keep you locked up for weeks. Now. Now, the redbud is an understory tree that can be spotted throughout New York City. It is cold hardy and can withstand the occasional cold snaps of winter, and it is endurant of the rising temperatures resulting from climate change. Alongside the nearly 5,000 known samples lining the streets of New York City, there are countless examples of this species being found in the city's parks, lawns, and courtyards. You can pick up one for free at any one of NYRP's tree giveaways. Now stay tuned for more tree talks from NYRP.